Hello everyone and welcome to a tutorial on how to get the S rank damage on the Mechlord raid duel. So let's just take a look at the deck first of all. This is it here. So this is my build, you don't have to use the same build. So what we're using is the skill Shooting Star Road, which let's look at that. So it starts with a Junk Converter in your graveyard, and when you've got a, a Stardust Dragon on the field, you can summon a Formula Synchron, but for the rest of the turn you can only summon Wind Dragon Synchro Monsters from your extra deck. Now the important part here is to have the three Junk Synchron, that's absolutely required. The next part is the three Junk Converters, or you can have Tuning. Either of those are fine doesn't matter which ones you've got. So all you really want is three Junk Synchrons and four cards that can search Junk Synchron. The rest of it is all just tuners. Doesn't matter what tuner, any tuner is fine. And then for the extra deck, you don't need these X's. Just have a Junk Warrior, have a Stardust Dragon, and have a Shooting Star Dragon. The rest of it is completely unnecessary. And that's all you're looking for. So let us go in to the event. Let us spawn. We'll just use 50 of these. Now it has to be a turbo duel, so let's go into the turbo duel. And we're just going to start without using any of the items. Now drawing into a Junk Synchron is something that's required, so we have to get lucky. Okay, we don't have Junk Synchron, but we do have the Junk Converter, which will allow us to search Junk Synchron. And we drew into Junk Synchron anyway. So the first thing we want to do is we want to activate our skill. And just bring out a Formula Synchron. And go into a Shooting Star Dragon. Now this is the reason that you want to fill your deck with as many synchros or as many tuners as possible, is so that we can activate the skill. So there's one, two, three, four. So he gets four attacks this turn. Now we're not going to be we're not going to try and kill the opponent this turn. Instead we're going to wait. We can actually do the rest of these because he's gonna have more than enough health. And this just drains his health even more. So the objective that we're going for is we're going to try and multiply Shooting Star Dragon's attack by 25. So we're not going to do anything this time. We're just going to use the attack, use the effect to get off multiple attacks again. Because sometimes he can use uh, wise old things, which allow him to summon more monsters. So let's see how many we can get off here. Okay, we can do another one. And another one. Okay, so he's only got 5,000 life points left. So we're going to end our turn there. So we can see we have 9 on our turbo duel. So we're going to remove 8 of our spell speed counters to multiply all of my synchros in the field by 5. So the attack multiplied by 5. Use Junk Synchron, yes. We're going to get back Junk Converter. We're going to make a Junk Warrior. I'm just skipping the animations uh, just for speed. Use the effect of the Junk Converter to get back Junk Warrior once again. And then we're going to Synchro into Stardust Dragon. And then we're going to activate the skill again. 
So it's going to multiply the attack of all of our synchro monsters by five. He's already been he's already been multiplied by five, so he now goes up to eight hundred and twenty-five thousand attack. And when he attacks, that uh, attack is going to be multiplied as well. So we can use the effect. So it gets one, two, three attacks. And now we're going to declare the attacks. Then shooting Star Dragon. He's going to deal, what was that, 400,000? Or is that a 4 million attack? I think it's 400,000 attack. And of course the radio is complete. You can see there, there's my score at the top. Gets quite a lot of things. And their damage is 22,000, radio boss 10,000. And, oh, so there you go, there is the highest damage that I've done. That was a new total. So I did 517,500 damage with that one turn. And that's how you do it. So all you want to do is multiply your Shooting Star Dragon's attack by 25. And in order to do that, you basically just summon the Shooting Star Dragon, wait two turns, and then summon a Stardust Dragon using Junk Warrior, or Junk Synchron, sorry. And that gives you enough uh, speed dual tokens, or the speed points, whatever they're called. Um, and yes, that is all you need to do. So remember that you can only have a maximum of 16 speed tokens or you can only have a maximum of 12 speed tokens, sorry, and what you need is 16. So there's no point in multiplying your Stardust Dragon's attack by 5 and then ending your turn. You have to do it twice in the same turn. So that's why it's important to wait twice, wait, end your turn twice with Shooting Star Dragon to clear the opponent's field, clear all the monsters, and then you can get that 25 multiplier. And of course, yet the damage is dealt is also multiplied because you're using the shooting star dragon and that is going to be it for this video folks i hope you all enjoyed that explanation that little tutorial if you did please give us a like share and subscribe do leave a comment below for your chance at winning a prize worth 100 pounds and if you want to talk to me you can find me in the discord in the description below and that's going to be it for this video folks i hope you all enjoyed and we'll see you all in the next video goodbye everybody